o'clock. Reverend Graham joins us. Nice to see you, sir. Nice to see you, Greta. Um, you have written the president on May 14th. I take you haven't received an answer back, have you? No. Uh, why did you write him? Uh, Greta, I didn't suspect uh, really anything. Uh, well, excuse me, I did suspect a little bit. Both Samaritan's Purse and the Billy Graham Evangelist Association, uh, on September, uh, we received a letter. In both both dated the same. Both same, dated same. Same day. I got copies of both. That yeah. we were being audited. And, uh, and they have a, a long list of things that they wanted to say, which is fine. They have the right to come audit us, uh, and, and this is a, an issue. And we were glad to work, in, work with them. The agent that they sent, a nice fellow, a very, very professional. So th there's a lot of great people in the IRS, and I don't want a broad brush that the, all these people are bad people. Uh, there's a couple, of, I think, of bad apples. Uh, but they came to, in the auditors after uh, the audit, uh, after the election, we, we got a letter that everything was all clear. There was no change to our Form 990. Uh, but then we had another issue. The Billy Graham Association is, uh, in, was incorporated in Minneapolis. We've moved our office from Minneapolis to Charlotte, North Carolina. We decided to open up a North Carolina corporation and then file for tax exempt status for that North Carolina corporation. Normally something like that would be five, six, maybe nine months at, at, the, at, the, at the most. Uh, Greta, it took 14 months. And we had nine different follow-ups with the IRS asking them, do they need more information? What's the status? And they said it was awaiting uh, for, for someone to, to look at it. But there's no reason for 14 months, Greta. So when all of this news broke, I just started wondering if there's some, if, if maybe the IRS is targeting Christian groups. Since we have spoken out, Greta, there's been another, other, uh, excuse me, a, a number of other Christian organizations now that have come forward and say, hey, we too, we have been audited as well. And I don't know, Greta, I, 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 but I've asked the president to look into it because if they are targeting us because of our, our conservative uh, religious beliefs, I think it's wrong. See, Greta, I believe, I believe the Bible to be God's word from cover to cover. Um, and I believe it to be true. Jesus said, I'm the way, the truth, and the life, and no man comes to the Father but by me. Uh, I, I want to, to, to stand by God's word. Uh, when it came to, in North Carolina, we had the marriage amendment uh, of last year. And we supported the marriage amendment, and we took out ads with money that was donated for that purpose, supporting the marriage amendment. And it was after that that you got the audit letters. That's when we got the audit letters, and also the agent, when he came, when mentioned that uh, that had been one of the complaints. All right, well, so the president, maybe we'll get back to you on your May 14th letter. Um,